Hey, I'm Doug Doppler, and on behalf of Tech 21, I would like to welcome you to the Studio to Stage video series, where today we're going to be checking out the Tech 21 character series pedals into the Tech 21 Power Engine 60. The Power Engine was designed to be the perfect complement to these pedals, so you can take the killer tones you can get with these in the studio, take them into your rehearsal space where your guitar can interact with an actual 12-inch Celestian, and in turn take that whole experience out onto the concert stage. And to demonstrate that, we're going to close mic the Power Engine 60 with a Shure SM57, focusing the mic on the edge of the dust cap of the speaker. So the first pedal we're going to check out is the Liverpool, and that's based on a Vox AC30. <laughs> So that gets us to the Leeds pedal, which is based on a high watt. So now we're going to switch from the leads to the Oxford, which is based on an orange amp. We're going to take the idea I played on the leads, which is kind of like an intro, and we're going to kind of move as if we're going to the verse, playing that on the Oxford. <laughs> So now we're going to switch over to the U.S. Steel, which is based on a Mesa Boogie dual rectifier. So the last two pedals in my signal chain are both delay pedals, the Boost DLA and the Boost DLA with tap tempo. And I'm using them like I might use them live. For all four of the demos you just heard, I was using the regular Boost DLA without any boost added. In fact, I'm going to switch that puppy off. And for the last demo, you're going to hear me use the Liverpool and the Boost DLA with tap tempo. And you'll hear when I kick in that pedal, I've dialed in just the right amount of boost for the part. <laughs> So now that we've had a chance to hear all these guys together, let's take a moment and kind of talk about the feature sets. First of all, Tech 21 pioneered the concept of direct guitar recording, and every version of Pro Tools all over the world ships with the legendary Sans Amp plugin. Each of the character series pedals is modeled after a classic tube amp using Tech 21's legendary analog technology. What's really cool is each one of these pedals has a ton of great tones hanging out inside there. And to help you get them, Tech 21 has included an insert with presets that comes with each pedal. I think one of the things I love most about the character series pedals is recording direct with them in the studio. And the speaker emulation circuit, which you can switch in and out via a button on the face of the unit, sounds amazing. So once you've got your tones all dialed in and your signal chain put together, the Power Engine just does a great job of bringing pedals like this to life. If you run them into your average guitar amplifier, the preamp's going to color the tone. If you run into the Power Amp Return, you've usually bypassed their master volume. The Power Engine actually doesn't have a preamp to color your tone, although it does feature a three-band EQ, which means you can make subtle adjustments as you move from room to room. In a combination with the onboard volume control, you should very rarely have to go back to your pedals to make adjustments as you move from venue to venue. Designed and manufactured in the United States, the Power Engine will easily fit in the back seat of your car, but is very capable of getting quite loud. However, if you want to use more than one, it's easy to daisy chain them together using the XLR jacks found on the bottom of the chassis. Last but certainly not least, the Power Engine 60 ships with a 12-inch Celestian. And if you think about it, more 412 cabins all over the world come stock with Celestian speakers.